Hello guys, in this week's video today I'm going to show you how to remove your ExpressVPN software off your router. Now it's very simple, you will need to go to linksys.com to download the actual software to put back. Now I'll show you just how to do that, so go onto your web browser, doesn't matter which one, and type in your um, Wi-Fi um, public IP, mine is ExpressVPN. So then what you need to do for the password if you don't know it, it's the password behind the router. It'll be a number. So I'll just whack that in. Okay, I've whacked that in, and then I'll show you how to uninstall it. So I'm pretty sure it's under... I've got to remember where it is. Okay, there, yep, this is it. Backup and uh, flash firmware. So then you've got to click on browse, then click on the thing the website told you. If Now this is for a Linksys, so if you go to Linksys, um, just do the way I said it. So go to linksys.com and look up firmware, and you need to whatever your router name is. So this is mine, uh, mine's um, version 2, so I download that, and it's the Linksys 1200 AC, so we'll download that. Well, we won't download it, we'll put that in, right here. Okay, and then we'll hit flash image. So if you've got, an, if you've got a router off ExpressVPN and you, you're not with ExpressVPN and you just want to use it as a normal router, do this exact step, it will work. So then when that's done, um, we'll show you what you do next. Okay, so it's fully um, uninstalled now. Now as you see, there's um, it'll say sorry at the top. Okay, when it says that, what you have to do then, you have to open another browser in, or just hit refresh, okay? But open another browser like I have and then hit refresh and it'll bring you to this page. Okay, and this is to set up the router. So you just got to agree to it all, and then hit next. And I did not hit agree. And then you can use it for anything you want. Um, you can download other third party softwares, or you can just use it as a normal router. But um, this is how to uninstall ExpressVPN on a Linksys router. It's very simple. I don't like ExpressVPN for the simple fact, if you don't, um, have ExpressVPN anymore, you can't use it as a normal router. They want you to have a subscription with them. So that's uh, very annoying. So just hit it next again. And then you'll just have to make that the same. You don't have to, but I always do. And you're just gonna wait. So yeah, I hope this video helped you guys out a bit at how to uninstall it. Because I asked ExpressVPN how do you uninstall it, and they sent back to me you can't. It's it's locked into the router. And I went that I thought to myself that can't be possible. It can't be locked into the router. Um, so it's not. They just want you to always be paying their monthly subscription. So I figured a way out how to not have to pay that subscription fee for just using normal internet, your normal internet. Now this is a router. You can get a modem one of these routers. So if you've got a modem one with ExpressVPN, same steps apply. So it's all the same. Okay, so then you'll need to put a password in here. Uh, I'm just going to put password. So we'll just copy password in. Put whatever you want. This is so someone in your house or you just want to change a couple of settings on your router, you need a password to um, change it all. So I'm just going to keep it as password. Now this is not your Wi-Fi password, this is the password to muck with this stuff. So just put it as what you want. Um, now we don't want that, so we'll just hit next.
and we should be. I'm not making an account. I don't know why they're directing me to that. Ah, oh, you've got to hit arm. Um, no thanks. Pretty sure. Yep, there you go. You're in. So that's all you have to do. And to um, reinstall software, I'll just show you. Um, yep, you just stay and then you hit choose file. And then you just choose now to download ExpressVPN back. You just click download the ExpressVPN files. Alright, cool. Um, hope you guys like this video and I'll catch you guys in the next video.